Well, hi everybody. Helpful husband here again. I got another assignment and luckily I never throw anything out. Over here, we have some old shelving that used to be in our root cellar. Had some problems with it because while it was pressure treated wood in a moist root cellar, it would get some molding on it. So I pulled it out, but didn't get rid of it. I've been hanging on to it. It's kind of an eyesore. You probably see a lot of old scrap wood. I see a new sled for training donkeys. Okay, so this is what we salvaged out of our scrap wood. From our shelf system, we took three shelves, which are nothing but a couple of two by fours and some plywood decking. And an old shed that we tore down. I still had this 16 foot two by seven plank. This will be our runners. This will be our decking. We've got some scrap two by fours. Let's see what we can put together. Okay, so let's take a little uh, progress report on our donkey training sled. Of course, you know, we had those shelf sections and they were basically two by fours with a piece of plywood on them. We took them and we trimmed them down to four feet long. We took that 16 foot two by seven and I cut two seven foot skids for the sled rails. We rounded out the front while leaving some structure here because that's where we're gonna attach the drag for it. I've tacked it down with um, deck screws just to put it together. We're going to lag bolt it later so we have something a little stronger. I'm going to put some cross bracing on it so it can handle bumpy loads and, and any kind of, you know, if the donkey bolts for a few steps. And then we'll put a handrail on it. But it's coming along real nice. It's going to be a four foot wide by seven foot sled and it'll be made out of completely recycled materials. So let's see how it turns out. Okay, so let's see how we're coming along on our donkey sled. What I've done is gone in, because we don't want those rails to splay open, and I've run some two by four stringers to keep those rails aligned. We've capped it front and back with two more two by fours. And then we added a rail system so when the donkey listener's running it, she can lean up against it. We've braced it. Come around to the front. Took a little boring drill, four to one inch hole, attach the chain, and then right at the center of the chain, this is about a six foot chain, put a carabiner clip so she can attach um, her single tree to it. And there you have it. Now, the next step is it's time to field test it. 